Okay, today's class we're talking about methods of cookery and what we're demonstrating are direct and indirect sources of heat, uh, both on grills, as well as what's called a water smoker, uh, and then we're also doing a rotisserie cook. And so all of these are using uh, various Weber products as far as the Weber grill, the, the Weber smoker, and then the Weber kettle grill with the rotisserie attachment. Our challenge is, is how do you demonstrate methods of cookery that anybody can go use without having to have lots of dollars tied up in very fancy equipment. Uh, so what we've got are kind of the, the low end as far as something where, you know, for 80, 90, a couple hundred bucks maybe at the most, you have a chance to be able to go out and buy these kinds of, of uh, cookers, either the grills or smokers, and have a chance to be able to learn how to cook with them. The first cooker that we will demonstrate today is the, the smoker, often referred to as the water smoker. And so, John, would you open that up or show that to, as far as the method of cookery we have there? The second method of cookery that we have is the rotisserie. So we're using a Weber grill with a rotisserie attachment here. And Carson has that and is showing the product going uh, in its full rotisserie there. Then we have two Weber grills, one set up for direct heat, which is the one that they're demonstrating now, and the product is directly over the coals that are underneath that. And then the second Weber grill here has got the indirect heat. So we have the pork loin laid out with a the charcoal, lit charcoal on the sides and the little baskets so that the heat is more uh, coming up from the sides and further away and again uh, demonstrate an indirect heating source. What we're going to do is we're going to take uh, all four pork coins from each cooking method. Uh, we'll take it in the classroom, cut it up, give it to each of the students and each one will be assigned a symbol or a letter, letter distinguishing it from another. Uh, which will be unknown by the students and then they'll rank it accordingly from best to worst and then once we have all the votes in then we'll go ahead and tell them which loin ranked the best which one ranked the worst. What we thought was going to happen is that the rotisserie and the water smoker would be uh, the highest or the most well liked most re well received just because they were cooked the longest and should have had the most uh, juiciness uh, to the cuts themselves. Uh, what actually happened is that everybody pretty much preferred the direct heat method, which was the shortest method that we used, and it's also the one that is the driest uh, for the cut itself. Rotisserie was second um, favorite amongst everybody, um, and it did have a lot of moisture to it. And then following that was the uh, indirect pork loin that was cooked, and then, uh, and then last, finally, was our barrel smoker, which kind of caught us off, I guess, by surprise. It didn't really have the charred flavor to it. It was just more the, just the regular pork flavor. A little bland and uh, more just like your smoke flavor. 